Today, I'm gonna to be talking through how to build a capsule wardrobe. Because who doesn't want a capsule wardrobe? These are like timeless pieces. So things that you can just wear forever. Like it won't, it won't go out of fashion. You can just style them with anything. I think when it comes to fashion, you need to bring it back to basics. To start an outfit, you need a basic item. Every single person needs basic items. You're not just gonna go out and buy the most extravagant thing you start with small basic things and then you build onto it this video has been so requested so let's get into it i'm gonna start with trousers as you see we've got a lot of trousers here so starting off gray joggers i said this in my other video i don't think joggers will ever go out of style like oh just want to get one leg joggers go with everything they're comfy they're cute they're basic. You can dress joggers up or you can dress them down. I think tracksuits are very dressy now. If you have your hair and makeup done, you go out in a tracksuit, you look cool. Before, no. I definitely think grey joggers are such a basic essential that you need in your wardrobe. Then obviously, I'm not going to sit here and say every single colour of joggers. Black joggers, grey, black joggers. I mean, you can have joggers in any colour you want, but I think grey and black very staple pieces like they go with everything gray and black such a good color to like pair things with these ones are from lux kill those ones are from cradle thing i didn't say that oh my goodness the fit of these are so nice they're so comfortable kind of similar to joggers actually they give off the same vibes like they're like comfy these are white linen trousers from bershka they have like two pockets on the back elasticated waist i love these i was just saying to someone that you can wear these in every single season of the year and it would still look cute they are a bit thin so maybe not winter i mean i wore them in winter and it was fine but if it's raining don't wear them when it's raining because they will go see through then onto jeans just having a pair of staple jeans is what you need like something that you can wear everything with like a pair of jeans that you can wear anything with i could wear this hoodie with these jeans these are from zara and this is the most perfect color blue i wanted some blue jeans this color for the longest time look how perfect they are like i cannot make this up i will never get rid of these jeans these will be in my wardrobe forever however i did have to cut the bottom of them they were already like Braid. is that the word i had to cut them shorter because they weren't short enough they just like dragged along the floor so it was really annoying i also love this like detailing on the back it does say zara on it i feel like you can't really tell but yeah and then i also have these in like a gray slash black color i'm actually wearing them now so i can't show you them but i'll put a photo of them on the screen i love these jeans so much I wear them every single day. They go with everything. They're not like a black either. They're like a grey slash black. I don't really like jet black jeans. I don't know what it is. They just look cheap. I don't know what it is. Now onto tops. Starting off with these slinky basics from Zara. These are so good because they're very affordable and they just are so hugging. Like they make your figure look so nice. That's what I love about these because... You can get tops like this from anywhere, but the Zara ones just fit so nicely. And I love the material, it's like a slinky material. Like in summer, it's such a nice material to wear because you can't like sweat in it or anything. I just love these so much, they go with everything. And then I actually got this top today and I'm obsessed, but just like big baggy t-shirts. I mean, this one's got something on it, so it's not gonna be a timeless piece because this will look weird in a few years. Any sort of baggy t-shirt, love stuff like this. I love baggy tops, I love baggy t-shirts. I have so many, but just where I got this one today, I just thought I'd show you this one instead of showing one of my old ones, because you've probably seen them hundreds of times. And then another basic of mine is one of these tops from Cotton On. This ribbed material, but it's very thin. That's what I don't like about it, the fact it's very thin. But they're so comfortable and you can also just wear these with anything and it looks cute. This is also like a seasonal thing, like you can wear it in winter, summer, spring. They're very affordable as well. Some of these things look so much better on. Let me know if in like the next fashion video if you want me to put like videos slash pictures or you just like me just showing them. This isn't really a top, but I'm just putting it under tops. These sort of knitted sweaters, these will never go out of fashion. When it comes to stuff like this, like basics, capsule wardrobe things 
you need to just invest your money like this was from primark and it was like 10 pounds this is gonna last me so long but if you're gonna buy something definitely spend more money on a basic than individual thing like with this hoodie i'm pretty sure it was like 60 pounds but it is a grey basic hoodie, but I'm going to wear it all the time because it goes with everything. And people hate spending money on basic stuff, but I think it's the other way around. Like, why would you spend money on something that you're only going to wear once or twice? Now onto jackets. You can just see them all on my bed. This one is a trench coat from White Fox. And this is another thing. Like, trench coats never go out of fashion. I feel like every year they come back into fashion at winter time. They're just so stylish and cool. I love them so much. This one isn't a massive like capsule wardrobe thing. Not everyone would buy this, but I'm just kind of just giving an example of like a leather jacket. You know, just like a going out jacket, something you could wear when you're going out for drinks, something you could wear if you're going on a walk, just something that you could always wear. Like I have worn this so many times. This isn't everyone's style, obviously. It's like a dark green and this is from zara i'm saying this isn't everyone's style but i'm pretty sure every girl owns one of these jackets the molly may jacket i think i will keep this for a very long time i think the problem with this jacket is it was like overhyped everyone got it and now it's kind of like oh i don't want to wear it because everyone has it this one can be quite controversial i feel like a lot of people don't like denim i don't know why well not denim but like a denim jacket but i absolutely love my denim jacket and it comes out every summer i think i've had this for like three years i actually cut it myself it is from pretty little thing but i did cut it myself so you probably won't find this one on there i feel like denim jackets will always be in fashion whether you like them or not they're always going to be in fashion i feel like they come out every single year literally everyone has a denim jacket like my mum has a denim jacket if you don't have a denim jacket what are you doing with your life this is another thing that may not be everyone's cup of tea. I just love a long coat. Like, I will be keeping this for years. This is from H&M. It was only like £30, but I think it was on sale. You can just wear anything under it as well, like tracksuits, jeans, a nice top if you're going out. And last of all is my cute little North Face coat. This is another thing I've had for years and I know these will never go out of fashion. North Face is like one of the biggest companies out there. Like I feel like every single person. I'm sure there's someone in your household that owns North Face. There is. I know there is. And it actually keeps you warm. That's the good thing about it. I know they're very expensive but it actually does keep you warm. Then moving on to shoes. I don't even know why I'm showing these because I know these are going out of fashion and I know a lot of people don't like these and call them like dad trainers but I love these. Everyone has personal preference. I'm showing you what I would personally wear in a few years time but I say that but then there's trends isn't there. I wear these to the gym so your own gym shoes they are like a capsule piece of wardrobe. You should get a pair of gym shoes like invest in gym shoes because you can wear them on dog walks, you can wear them on hikes, you can wear them running. If you don't exercise ignore this. I will definitely keep these for a few years. This is also quite controversial. I feel like with the shoes everyone has their own preference so i'm just going to show my shoes and then if you prefer like a certain pair of shoes obviously keep them i feel like converse i love my converse but i'm not going to show them because they are so dirty but i feel like converse a lot of people wear converse if i'm showing like these and you like converse then just think in your head that i'm talking about converse like these are my everyday shoes so like just imagine your everyday shoes invest in a pair of everyday shoes that you can just wear with everything i'm obsessed with these at the moment these are the adidas campus zeros i'm pretty sure and last of all the shoes i think uggs like not specifically these uggs but uggs always every single year they come into fashion everyone's like i want uggs i want uggs literally get a pair of uggs and they will last you like 10 years and then you'll never have to want uggs because you'll just have uggs for the longest time for like two or three years i was like i want uggs i want uggs i finally got some and now i don't have to sit there and say i want uggs like i've actually got my own pair of uggs these are actually fake these ones aren't real these are like 20 pounds i'm pretty sure i don't really wear these though out of the house get yourself a pair of uggs i also have my slipper uggs and i wear these in the house Uggs in the house, Uggs out the house, they will always be in fashion. Last of all, for bags, you need a bag in every colour. So starting off with this cream one, I feel like all my bags are like different styles as well. Like this is kind of a long bag, I love this bag. 
obviously it's cream can go with like cream outfits and then we've got my fake Louis Vuitton one this was like 20 pounds and it's so good I've had it for like two years and it's lasted me such a long time but this is my summer bag like I love taking this holiday with me I'm kind of looking at it now though and I'm like I don't even like it anymore I definitely invest in bags because i do think they last forever i literally never chuck out my bags like i have so many bags and i've never gone like that's not a nice bag like i feel like you never get bored of your bags last of all is my christian dior fake bag as well don't want to say it but it is fake the real one's like four grand i'm sorry i'm not spending four grand on a bag like if it gets stolen you just had four grand stolen like i cannot no they're definitely cute and just a plain black bag i mean this one has like detailing on it and that's why i love it so much but any plain black bag so we've got like white black and then like a brown kind of bag invest in your bags invest in your capsule wardrobe i hope this helped you guys get an idea of what to invest your money in instead of just buying things that you're probably never gonna wear again and then you've just wasted like loads of money on it i've learned that the hard way i love you all so much and i hope you enjoyed this video